split second, a Metro Atlanta woman's life is shattered. What looked like a minor car accident on South Cobb Parkway stole part of her vision. Tonight, she tells our Caitlin Ross people need to open their eyes to the danger right in front of their face when they get out on the roads. Getting in the car is getting easier for Hannah Oliver. At first, it was very stressful. It was a lot of anxiety. Anxiety about what she's missing. You, right here, I can't see you. And what she's lost. I actually have no depth perception. Really? Don't get nervous. <laughs> her easy smile and her sunglasses covering the hard truth of her accident. It's excruciating pain, like the worst pain I've ever felt in my life. Wearing sunglasses when she got into a minor fender bender on South Cobb Drive. As soon as the airbag hit my eye, it literally shattered into pieces. Airbags deploy at a speed of 200 miles an hour with a force of up to 2,000 pounds. That's an impact most sunglasses just can't withstand. Hannah lost her right eye just three months before her wedding, finding the courage to talk about it online. When a video goes viral, it's like, do, 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 do. My airbag came out, hit my precious designer sunglasses, and they shattered into a million pieces. She found out she wasn't alone. I've connected with hundreds of people that have lost their eye the same exact way. People have lost their eye through sunglasses, and it's because we're not making them safer. I've got a pair here. Safety here. is something optometrist Frank Winsky thinks about a lot. The eye doctor says anyone getting behind the wheel with glasses or sunglasses should have polycarbonate lenses in the front. Frame. It's basically shatterproof, or it'll take a significant impact and not break. The polycarbonate material is more expensive than glass or plastic, but tested rigorously for safety. What I could only find was like sporting sunglasses or like fishing sunglasses, but I am a girl's girl and that was not gonna work for me. Hannah set out to create both, designing her own sunglass line. 100% protective is what I say but also stylish. With shatter-resistant polycarbonate lenses. We shouldn't have to think about it when we put sunglasses on our face that we might have to lose our eyesight, that we might be partially blind or blind because of something that we're wearing on our face. Hannah thinks polycarbonate lenses should be mandated. It's standard for kids' glasses, but after turning 18, it's an upcharge to get the stronger material in a lens. If that would have been a law, like, I would have my... I would have my vision right now. We, you would be in the car with a driver that has two eyes and not one. <laughs> now she's driven to use what she does have for good. I feel like this happens for me for a reason, and I feel like I can be a voice and change things, and I hope through my story that I can change the eyewear industry. By the way, you know, it could be really tricky to spot polycarbonate glasses if you're trying to buy a new pair of sunglasses. Now, you could find the materials on the, on the small tags attached to the sunglasses, and they're going to be a lot more expensive than you would find in a box store. So a polycarbonate pair of glasses could cost you around 100 bucks.